Hi, it's Kim from Be Your Own Graphic Designer and a Canva champion, which is shortly going to become a Canva ambassador or a Canvasador, which again is a made up word that's going to be difficult to say. Today, I wanted to go through one of the very recent introductions to Canva's new magic suite of tools. I'm going to go over and share my screen and show you exactly what this one is. It's a quickie. I love this. It's really, really useful. This is a slide from a recent slide presentation I've been doing in my other business. And I thought I'd just show you how you can convert this very easily with what's now called Magic Switch. This used to be called Magic Resize, and before that it was just Resize, but now it's called Magic Switch, and there's a load more you could do with it. But the biggest benefit I've found is that you could actually copy and resize an individual page or element from a either a slide presentation or just a whole series of documents. I find it amazingly useful. Let me click this down. You can also translate this into another language. I'll just select a language here. And I'm going to select Portuguese. And I do have to say Magic Switch is a Canva Pro or Teams feature. I will put a link below this video where you can try Canva Pro for free for 30 days. I'm going to go to Portuguese because as many of you may know, that's where I live. And I'm going to apply it just to this page. You can see, as when you download, it's given me the option of doing it to all the pages there. I'll take that off, or just the current page I'm on here. So I'm going to click Done, and I'm going to click Translate. And that's asking me to open that presentation. Now just get this one slide in Portuguese, which it is, but the word marketing is the same in Portuguese as well. How easy was that? Fantastic. As I've said with Translate before, you do need to make sure it's accurate so you don't look silly, but this is really great. Let me go back now, and I'm going to do something else. So that's copied and translated really fast. As you can see, I can transform it into a document. I'm not going to transform it into a document. I'm going to do that in a different video, because what I want to do is show you the resize options. And you can see I can search for them here. Or I can click on custom, resize, social media, print, presentations, videos, websites. Those are all my options. And I'm going to just click on the social media one because so you can see what they all are. And there's Reels, TikToks, Facebook. They're all wrong there. So I can just click on those if I want to go into one. So if I want a LinkedIn post, I can do that. And if I want a Facebook post, I could click on the Facebook option. And I'm going to do a Facebook landscape post. It's not quite so obvious here, so don't make the mistake and select all of them. You can just select the pages and click on that and then click that down again. You can click on that. It doesn't bring up the current page option. I hope Canva are going to add that as an improved feature. But I'm going to go down and this page is number 37. So just scoot down here. And go to page 37 and then click done and then continue. It provides me with a preview of it, and it will need some adjustment, but these always need some adjustment, as you know, when you copy and resize, but it's still hugely time-saving. And now I'm gonna click on copy and resize. And I'm gonna open this Facebook post. This is one of my favorite quotes. And actually, that is almost perfect. I'm not that bothered about that. I might move that across a little and make it a little larger. Move Michael's name down a little. And that's it. I actually have an instant Facebook post from work I've done already. Being able to repurpose content, it just makes your life so much simpler and just saves you time. I hope that helped. And I'll be back next week with some of the other new features from Canva's Magic Suite. See you then.